eyes are on the table. All this talk of legalization, regulation, you guys have any clue to really the revenue generators here? This would be a shameless, just a total shameless money grab, and that's how we're going to handle it. There's several pies on the table. The first one is consumption and distribution. Pie number one is the annual certified user of pot revenue. In other words, the ACUPR, annual cup revenue. Certified user of pot is the cup. B, pie number two, basic urban distribution spots, or BUDS. Nice acronym. I came up with it a couple of years ago. <laughs> I always liked it. Anyway, number two revenue generator with sub-generators is certified home urban growers, or the CHUGS. Now, believe it or not, I've done the numbers here, and we can't actually grow enough to satisfy the American demand all on our own. And we're going to need these home ur urban growers, and this is a way to get the buds off the streets and away from kids, because there's always going to be someone out there. So we have Pi 3, which is the Chug application fees. Pi 4, the Chug training fees. Like I said, shameless. We're going to get as much money as we can out of this. Pi 5, the Chug certification fees. So we got them for application, training, and certification. Then we come into the Chug Grow Rooms. Pi 6 is the Chug grow, grow Room Application Fee. Pi 7 is the Chug Grow Room Inspection Fee. By the way, there's an additional, an additional Chug Growing Fee, or Fee in here for $250. It goes directly to the fire departments, the local fire departments that actually do a fire inspection on them that is not included in our numbers. So we got Pi number 8, which is the Room Certification Fee. So we got the Chug Application room inspection and room certification for the chug rooms not counting the chug actual application for just being a chug the training for just being a chug and the certification for being a chug then we have the chug seeds ain't getting no more seeds online none of that we're going to control the dna of the seeds we're going to have some annual contests and by joe <laughs> it's going to be fun but we're going to control this revenue completely chug seeds is pie number nine or, yeah, pie number nine. And then part five is the certified users of pot, the cups. They have pie number ten, which is the actual cups application fee, and then pie number eleven, which is the cups certification fees. Now, when we do the numbers and we show all this, we're also going to show that we're not going to totally stick it to the chugs. So there's certification fees. There will be fees that go in with being a chug that you'd have to go through otherwise. I think you get the idea.